Good morning, everybody. Or well, not so good morning to me. It's very late as I'm recording this because I'm super excited to record it. I'm Maple. Uh, here in the flesh. Not physically, but you know. You can see me for real. And I'm real. And I'm alive. I know I've been gone for a long time. I have my excuses. But I'm moving and I'm lazy. So, moving on. So, if you haven't seen from the title of the video, I'm going to be opening the 2018 6% Doki Doki Fukubukuro Lucky Bag. This is my first ever Fuku Lucky Bag Fukubukuro. If you don't know, every year in Japan, on New Year's Day, they have basically like an American Black Friday where they have a bunch of big sales. And the main thing that they like to do is uh, sell lucky bags, which are basically like grab bags. And you pay a lot less than what you receive in the bag, which is a super awesome thing. And I'm really excited to open this because it's my, like I said, it's my first time opening of Fukubukuro. And I can't, I can't contain my excitement. And that's another reason why I'm here, so I can show off the clothes or accessories or whatever. I have another Fukubuguro to open in another video. I'll do that later. But let's get started. Alright, so I ordered this from Tokyo Otaku Mode. And I, like I said, I ordered two Fukubuguro and the other one came before this one, even though I ordered this one first, which was interesting. So here it comes in this little box when you order it from Tokyo Takamoto. With this cute little file folder and sticker, which is awesome, took from them. They have their own customized box, which is also cute. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I already peeked at the bag. I haven't seen anything inside. I've never, I'm trying to get super into Japanese fashion. I've always been into, like, wanting to go to Japan ever since I was in elementary school, even before I was into anime. So, uh, I'm just, I'm super excited. The bag is really cute from what I can see. I don't know how well you can see it. Put it up here. Ah, I'm so excited. Oh, it's so cute. Alright, let's get into this as delicately as possible without damaging anything. So, the bag itself is like kind of like a gift bag material, so I don't know if I'd like use it as like a purse, but I'm definitely going to display it in my room. Like I said, I'm moving, so I currently don't have everything right now. And I don't know if you can see, but I have my pajama bottoms on. Ooh, such a crime. But I've been so tempted not to open this until I get to my new place. I can't wait. That's too long. So, oh, it's tight. Taped on the sides too. I'm fangirling on the inside right now. Alright, let's focus on the ba oh, bag a little more than me. I know you just saw me, it's exciting. But, okay, I'm just gonna blindly grab stuff out. I think it's all in one bag maybe? Okay, first thing is a large item. Ooh, it's a little purse, tote, so let's find the opening. Sorry if the plastic gets kind of loud. So we have this really cute little tote bag, super colorful and adorable. The texture is kind of, it's pretty thick, like a canvas bag, I'd say. And 
let's open the inside. It's just one big pocket. And the tag's really cute too, it has the same print. I don't know if this helps or anything. I'll set this next to me. And let's dig into the next item. Oh my gosh. What is this? I see a little unicorn. Oh my gosh, what is this? Alright, let's get that back. It's super soft. Oh my gosh, is it a scarf? It has this little clip right here. It's in the middle clasp. And there's the tag. Let's see if there's any description on it. Oh yeah, I paid $99 for this bag. And it said online that it was worth like 300 something dollars. US dollars. Oh my gosh. Okay, so it's got these beautiful hair. So I guess you can have like your pet unicorn hanging on your shoulder. That's so awesome. <laughs> uh, I'm so afraid to mess this up, but I'll tie it back up in a ponytail so it doesn't get totally tangled. But that's pretty awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. It's super soft, like really, really nice material. Set that to the side. Alright. Next up is a smaller item. Looks like a hair piece. It's a super soft like pom-pom little character. It has this little earring on the character's ear that's as six percent. Interesting. It has a little button pin and then a little hair clasp that you can do whatever you want to do with it. Super soft material. That's interesting, but I know they do a lot of bright, interesting, unique items. And yeah, it's a mix of random things. I just I'm not saying I don't like it. I'm I love I'm so excited. <laughs> Alright, digging deep. Ooh, it's a bunch of things. So first up we have this little hair clip which is super cute and sparkly. And it's got big bow on it and little pearls right here and it's super sparkly right here that's adorable then this little candy hair tie that's it's, I'm gonna say adorable and cute so many times cuz how can I not and oh my gosh it's a little duck ring <laughs> can you see that I'm like this is the most adorable. Everything is just wonderful and bright and it just makes me happy. Look at this little bow. These cherries. Um I don't I don't know how to It's pretty awesome. Okay, so maybe these are hair ties or rings. Or, I don't know, be whatever you want. But there's some little strawberry hair ties. They're pretty small. Luckily, I have pretty thin hair, so nothing to worry about there. And there's this bubble wrap ring in here. So we have this, it's a nice metal bow ring. It's different colors than usual. It looks kind of festive actually, the like, candy cane color. Alright, let's dig around and see how much more there is. Feel something wrong? I'm gonna look. 
Oh, that's it. There's only one thing left. Ah. Oh, is this a choker, I'm guessing? Uh, let's take out the packaging so we can all take a look. Just cut the plastic. I have scissors here for a reason. So it looks like we have this really cute bright blue choker. And then this has the same little 6% 6 tag as the little pom-pom here. And if you can't hear the jingle, it's got a little jingle bell and the super cute bow. Uh, everything is all so cute. You could probably make an outfit with a lot of these things, which is super awesome. Now, I know 6% is a pretty, like, pricey company, at least for me, I can't, that's why I don't really have very much Japanese fashion items, because I'm in the middle of America, and they're, it's expensive, and um, I don't have all of the money, and I splurged, and I'm happy that I did. This is definitely a lot. I don't know how much any any of this is worth because there's no price tags on anything. But I can look it up later. And I'm just gonna have my little buddy here. I don't know if you can see that. It kinda looks kinda sad right there. There you go. It's a little more friendly. So that's everything I got in there. Now, I don't know if this is all the stuff is worth $300, but maybe you guys do against it. I think I definitely got my money's worth with the $99, but it's all really cute stuff and I will definitely make use of all of these things. And let me know your opinion and what you think of Lucky Bags. I need to actually go to Japan and get Lucky Bags instead of ordering them overseas because that's a lot more expensive and a lot of, they get a lot less options. Then again, it's expensive to per a trip to Japan. <laughs> so anyways, I really hope you enjoyed this video and seeing my beautiful face, don't judge, um, I'm really happy to be coming back. I have a lot of videos that were recorded a while ago that I will edit and post. So keep up to date. I know I'm a very small YouTube channel right now, but in the meantime, tell your friends and family and make me happy. I hope you like everything and I'll make sure to stay alive. Good night everybody. Sweet dreams. Maple out.